All right, Todd's back on this uh, August Tuesday. <laughs> so, but you know, it's funny because, you know, it's certainly this time of year. Yeah. It's like jacket sweatshirt in the morning. No, it's, like I mean, it, right. it was cooler this morning, and then I'm it, like, today is going to be 80. Yeah, it's, <laughs> I, I was doing the same thing as I was looking at. I was comparing yesterday's temperatures to today's, and yesterday at this time it was actually a lot milder. Yeah. Um, and you know, this morning it's actually kind of cool. It cooled off last night pretty good. It did. It was yeah. great. It's good sleeping weather, you yeah. know. And it, the house is going to warm up this afternoon, and that'll keep some heat in it so that you don't turn it on overnight tonight. I don't know. This is great stuff. Uh, yesterday's highs, mid 70s. Bangor was the warm spot at 75. Berlin, New Hampshire, 75. Caribou, Augusta, 74. Portland, Lewiston in the lower 70s. And yeah, we're waking up to some 40s out there, especially near the coastline and over the southern half of the state. Sanford, the chilly spot right now at 43. Uh, there's Berlin, New Hampshire. Berlin, New Hampshire is always cold, 40 degrees there. And then you've got 46 in Lewiston. Uh, Bangor's 50, mid 50s across far northern Maine. There's some cloud cover up there, but this front is trying to get into the state won't be successful. It's running into this ridge, which is pumping heat around it and into New England. So this is going to be the hottest day of the stretch. Still waiting on this front right here. It's days away, but eventually it moves in Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Our temps start to slide. Our chances for rain go up and we probably end up with some drenching rain over the weekend. Timing's not good. A little bit of valley fog this morning. Not much otherwise clear. And there is a chill early on, so again, sweatshirts needed. Sunny with just a few clouds up north during the middle of the day. Look at how fast our temperatures jump. It'll be unseasonably warm by midday, right around 80. And then a lot of us get to the low 80s this afternoon, a lot of sunshine, and it's going to feel kind of hot when you're standing out there. The only good thing is there's virtually no humidity at all. It's not like 80 degrees back in July. It's not like 80 degrees in August. This is actually doable if you're working outdoors. Yeah, you're going to be a little on the hot side, but it's not going to be that bad. These are the records that we need to beat today. Portland 82, Bangor 77. I think Bangor shatters the record. High today, I'm going for 81. And we'll call it a tie in Portland. I'll go for 82 degrees. That would tie the record, which was set way back in the 1800s, like back when our records began. So this goes back, uh, you know, 100. Well, let's see. I, I can't even do the math. It's so it's like 150 years. It's crazy. 80 up in Berlin, New Hampshire, 81 Bangor, 75 Caribou. Again, a lot of us right around 80 degrees. Now tomorrow this high continues to work in and it's going to slide to our east. So we start to get some return flow in here more off of the water and off of the ocean that adds some moisture to the air. We're going to have a lot of fog in the mornings later this week, and that'll be a little tough to burn off, especially by Friday. Temperatures will be a little cooler because of that. And then over the weekend, here comes the front and the pattern breaks down with this front involved. A lot of rainfall coming in, drenching rain possible Saturday afternoon through Sunday morning. Through Friday evening, there might be some sprinkles from that low level fog and cloudiness that we have on Friday morning. But really the big rains hold off until late in the weekend and there could be a couple of inches of rain across the area. So we'll keep an eye on rivers and streams because we've had such a dry stretch. We'll probably be OK, but it's still worth watching. Marine forecast sees three to four southwest wind light. Mostly sunny today and tomorrow. It's going to be toasty out there. High temperatures in the low 80s today, upper 70s inland tomorrow. And then we've got more fog in the mornings, Thursday morning, Friday morning. It'll be tougher to burn off only a little bit of afternoon sunshine coastlines in the 60s on Friday. And then everyone's in the 60s over the weekend with showers returning Saturday afternoon, probably a period of heavy rain Saturday night into Sunday morning. And then we'll start clearing out a little bit as we get into early next week. And then it's it's normal October. It's right. normal October. That's cool. Not a bad, cool stuff. It's not Chilly a bad stuff. Thing. No, it's yeah. fine. I love fall. Fall's great. Yeah. So. All right. Thank you, sir.